Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm recording at Full HD 1080p uh, at 30 frames per second with the Sony Xperia X. The phone has a 23 megapixel sensor and it is the same sensor which it shares with the flagship phone from Sony so far in 2016, the Xperia X Performance. So let's have a look at the see how the sensor um, gets the autofocus on the Xperia X. Okay, as you can see, it's able to focus straight away. I didn't have to tap on the screen and I was able to autofocus very, very nicely. As you can see, the background has gone blurry as well. Whilst we do this, let's also do a thumb test to see how I focus on my thumb. Very, very nice. This is almost as good and as fast as on the Samsung Galaxy S7 and the S7 Edge. So, pretty impressive stuff. Okay, so let's try another leaf here then and see how it focuses. There we go. Without me tapping on the screen, it is able to focus straight away. So very, very impressive indeed so far from what I can see on the Sony Xperia X. Okay, so let's have a look on the sky and the clouds and change the exposure level a bit and see how the sensor reacts to light and slightly darkening conditions on the ground. Not too bad. The leaves, the trees, everything seems to be uh, very nice and clear. The colors are quite crunchy. Uh, in fact, I would say a bit uh, oversaturated, but still, uh, I'm sure mo most of you won't complain. So let's have a look on the flower here, then see if the focus is. As you can see, the flower actually is not that red. It is coming out as extra pink. Whereas from what I can see from my eyes, it's uh, actually on the light red side. But this is what I said to you earlier, it's a bit over saturated but I think a majority of people won't actually mind that. Okay, so now let's work along and see. I can't remember if the phone has optical image stabilization, it's a new sensor, a 23 megapixel sensor. But uh, I know this for sure that Sony has got their own uh, stabilization at the software level which in the past has done wonders. When I had the Sony uh, Xperia Z5, I remember it had some very, very good uh, video capabilities and without optical image stabilization, it was able to keep the video very, very steady. And from what I can see here so far, the video looks fairly steady, not too bad. Obviously, I can't tell you the exact quality from what I can see so far unless I upload the video on my channel or have a look on the PC. But please feel free to uh, let me know in the comment section uh, how do you find the video quality and I'll be more than happy to discuss whatever your findings are. From what I can see so far, live watching and recording, I think it looks pretty decent, not too bad. Let's try the focusing once more. There you go. It's able to focus on the leaves straight away without any issues. So the autofocus is really, really nice and very impressive so far from what I can see. So well done Sony for that, for giving us a good, decent video quality and also nice autofocusing uh, capabilities as well. So not too bad. So guys, the video is getting a bit longer, but as you know, I always make sure I shoot plenty of footage to give you a thorough, detailed uh, um, verdict and make sure that you guys know exactly how the camera and the sensor is like on phones that I review. So like always guys, if you like my video, please uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section. And like always, please subscribe as it really helps. And I shall see you in the next video.